Hello, Roman here, founder of Find Math Leads. Hope you're doing well. In this quick video, I'm going to show you how to use the Find Math Leads database as a MySQL format. You can use Find Math Leads for what? So it's very easy. You can extract email lists. You can uh, use it to do lead generation, and then, for example, do cold outreach. Uh, so in this quick video, I'm going to show you how you can extract data. Uh, for example, email lists, um, what emails are on a specific domain name. You can also get the count of how many Shopify's there are in the database and then extract them into a CSV file. So you can do many, many things. And you ha just have to know that Find Mass Leads is a giant database that I built uh, from scraping the web. And there are emails, there are uh, LinkedIn, there are uh, many, many domains, uh, about 100 million domains. So essentially, if you have a list of domain names, you can get data points about them. Or if you want domain names, for example, you have a technology in mind, for example, Klaviyo, Shopify, WordPress, WooCommerce, and so on, you just can get lists of domains of websites using these technologies. So here in this quick video, I show you very quickly how you can extract data from the MySQL database. You can purchase the database on my website, findmathleads.com. It's about 10 gigabytes uh, compressed, so it's a big database, and once uncompressed, it's about maybe 40 gigabytes. So you must have a lot, of, a lot of space available on your drive. So let's begin. As you see on the screen, there is a, a, a request, a query you can do in MySQL. Uh, don't worry about the complexity of the language. Here it's just a, a query that gets you the contact information about one specific domain. Here the domain is knowledgex.us. It's just an example, of course. So don't worry, I provide you with uh, some queries you can use. You just have to replace the domain name here and then press enter. And of course, you can compile the data into a CSV file. Here's how. So I just added this at the end of the query. It will compile into data.csv. So overall, you just have to use uh, this in a terminal, in a command prompt. Uh, you can have it on uh, Linux, a VPS, on Windows, anything. I will show you how to set up all this once you purchase the database. Don't worry about that. So I press enter and then you get a file that you can view. I have a specific command here that I can use to view the CSV. So you have the value, the first column, and then the second column, which is the type of the contact. And you get the contact uh, information, for example, two email addresses here, the LinkedIn contact and some Twitter handles here. Another query I would like to show you is how to get the technologies that a specific domain or website is using right now. So it's very easy. For example, here you see at the end of the query that I just replaced uh, the domain name with my specific domain name, which I want information about, knowledgex.us again. So let's press enter and you can see the list of technologies that it's using. We see that it's using WordPress as a common CMS here, Google Tag Manager, and also uh, very interesting technologies like ThriveCart, Thrive Leads, and also Calendly that you can see here. So you may guess here that this company uh, maybe is using ThriveCart, so it's doing uh, some kind of e-commerce, it's selling something. And of course, uh, if it's using Calendly, maybe it's uh, to do appointments with uh, potential customers which can be interesting to you. And of course, you can query any domain you want. If you have any domain name in mind, just replace the end of the query here with your domain name. Another useful query that you can use is to get domains list using a specific technology. So here is the query. You just have to replace here by the name with the name of the technology uh, you want to uh, look up. For example, WordPress, WooCommerce, uh, Google Analytics, Klaviyo. Uh, maybe you don't know this technology. It's just an email marketing tool. And here the request gets me the first 20 websites using that technology. You can see here the first column, which is the domain name, and the second column, which is the rank of the website. 
And something interesting here is that you can see oxyfresh.com with a good rank, a good global rank in the first 500,000 websites in the world. So it can be interesting to target if you have maybe copywriting skills because you are, they are using Klaviyo, which is an email marketing tool uh, to communicate with their customers. Maybe you can rewrite uh, their emails and uh, make them more relevant, more convincing, and maybe help them get more sales. Of course, you can uh, compile all this data into a CSV file and then upload the CSV file in an email verification uh, tool, uh, maybe a CRM, maybe a lead generation tool, or a cold outreach software. Here is how you can do it. Just add this at the end of the query. You press enter. So that's it. You have your file and you can view it using this specific comment. Again, don't worry about the complexity of the queries I'm using here in the terminal. Once you get the database, uh, again, it's on my website, findmasses.com. I will provide you with all these queries and you just have to replace specific things uh, with uh, your, uh, uh, what you're looking for. For example, here, the technology Clavio uh, and sometimes the domain name and sometimes the number of results you want here, 20. You may want to replace this with uh, 100 or maybe uh, uh, 10,000. So really don't worry about the complexity of the language. You will have the queries at hand. So let's have a look at the file. So here is the command to view the file. So you can see here the content of the CSV file. Then you can use the file maybe to gain more information if it's easier for you in my web dashboard. When you purchase the database, you also have access to the web dashboard where you can make specific queries uh, it's just that it's a bit slower and sometimes to get long lists of uh, uh, emails it's very slow so that's why i compiled all the find mass list database into a mysql format you can also upload this list into another tool if you want to so to give you a last example you have here a query that gets you the first 100 results you can see the 100 here uh, of the domains using Shopify. Okay, so I press enter and you get a list here with the domains. With MySQL language, you can do many, many, many things. You can sort the results. Um, you can get, for example, I had a, a customer a few weeks ago that uh, who asked me about uh, uh, email addresses containing the CPA, uh, the string CPA into the email address. You can do that with MySQL. You can do that once you purchase the database. It's very doable. I can help you with that or you can uh, find help on the internet about the MySQL language. There are many ways on how to query a database. Also, if it's useful to you, you could get all the email addresses of the database. Uh, it's very doable to do that. There are tens of millions of email addresses, maybe even hundreds of millions of email addresses um, in the Find Mass Leads database. You can extract them into many, many CSV files. Of course, you have to split the work so that you, the, the computer can, can do it. Also, you could ask, uh, you could get all the email addresses, uh, Gmail, so all the Gmails, all the Hotmails, for example. So you're just limited by your imagination and what, by what is contained into the database, what data it has. So to summarize the video, you can get the whole Find Mass List database as MySQL format uh, on your computer, or you can use a VPS. Bear in mind that it's a quite big file, so it's about 10 gigabytes compressed, about 40 maybe, it depends on the run, it depends on the, the last scraping and how big it is. So sometimes it's 50 gigabytes, it can be also uh, 80 gigabytes uncompressed so you have to, to have a lot of space on your computer and then you can query using the mysql language you can query the database and get results and compile the data into csv files if you need to uh, if you need to for example to upload the data into an email verification tool a lead generation tool a cold uh, outreach software and again the more common queries you can do is to get email addresses from a list of domain names, for example, 
uh, you can also get domain names from uh, uh, a particular web technology you have in mind, WordPress, WooCommerce, uh, Shopify, and so on. You can get all the email addresses contained in Find My List. You could get also all the LinkedIn profiles contained in uh, the database and use all of this for your business. I hope it was useful to you. I was Roman, founder of Find My List. If you have any question about how to use it, how to set up, just send me an email at support at findmathleads.com. Thank you very much and see you in the next video.